blood pressure is the force of the blood against the wall of the arteries for the normal functioning of your all the vital organs the blood pressure should be normal if the blood pressure is high the heart has to pump very hard and there will be a initial physiological changes adaptive changes later there will be pathological changes and then the heart leads to heart failure likewise all other vital organs like the kidneys brain and the eyes gets permanently damaged if your blood pressure is not under control so what is a normal blood pressure a blood pressure of 120 by 80 mm of mercury is considered as a normal blood pressure if your blood pressure is between 120 to 139 by 80 to 89 diastole mm of mercury it is known as pre hypertension at this stage you can adapt some lifestyle modifications so that you can avoid progressing into hypertension any blood pressure recordings of 140 systolic by 90 mm of mercury diastolic is hypertension let me tell you that you can adapt a few lifestyle modifications so that you can avoid progressing from pre hypertension to uncontrolled hypertension so lower your weight to maintain a good blood pressure so if you are obese or if you are overweight you should adapt lifestyle modification to reduce your weight so that your blood pressure becomes optimal or under control as your body weight increases the blood pressure also increases so losing even 10 pounds of your weight has got a significant difference in controlling your blood pressure next be physically active being physically active doesn't need that much of effort you should be physically active for at least 30 minutes on most week of the days in engaging in moderate intensity activities the moderate intensity activities such as playing sports bicycling swimming brisk walking all these are all in comes under moderate intensity activity you can have a brisk walk at least 30 to 45 minutes on most of the days in a week for example you can even do gardening wash your car these are all comes under moderate intensity activities in regular course next adapt a healthy diet plan what you eat does really matters in affecting your blood pressure so for maintaining a good healthy eating plan adapt a dash diet we call it as dietary approach to prevent systemic hypertension this is called dash diet the dash diet includes a food which is low in saturated fat total fat and cholesterol and food which are high in fruits vegetables most of your dash diet contains a food which is high in fiber high in potassium calcium and magnesium before you eat look out what you are eating so that it doesn't affect your blood pressure eat a food which is low in sodium and less salt rather than spice up your food and reduce your sodium content or salt in your food then if you are a smoker or a tobacco chewer quit smoking and then stop tobacco chewing so that your blood pressure also comes back to normal then if you are already an hypertension patient and you are already on medications be compliant with your medication so that you don't forget to take your medicines regularly and in time and if you are already an hypertension patient on medications pay a regular visit to your doctor and you and your doctor should team up what is the optimal or the desirable blood pressure for your age so that you can optimize the medications and keep your blood pressures very much under control so that the blood pressures doesn't affect your vital organs and keep all your vital organs functioning normal remember hypertension is the number one leading cause for heart attacks and then also for stroke heart attack is the number one leading cause of death as well as stroke is number third leading cause of death so controlling your blood pressure by adopting a healthy lifestyle as well as by taking your medications regularly prevent these events thank you